Hello and welcome. So in order to create uh, your custom switch panel in Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020, you need to go ahead and download to MobiFlight. This is a software that allows integration between Arduinos and Flight Simulator. So make sure your Arduino is plugged in into any of your COM ports and run the program. Now navigate to Extra Settings and MobiFlight's modules. Uh, here you will see all the Arduinos that are currently plugged into your computer. What we need to define now is which pins we're using for our encoder. So we need to add a device, uh, in this case an encoder. I'm going to connect it to pin 7 and 8. doesn't really matter which is uh, the left and the right one. You can always swap it. And I'm going to leave uh, the type as it is and name it uh, Heading Encoder, for example. So now we can upload these settings into the Arduino. Now that the software knows that we've uh, connected an encoder to pins number 7 and 8, we need to tell him what to do with this information. So make sure you're in Input and let's create a new configuration. In this case we're going to name it Autopilot Heading. Now we click Edit and we uh, choose the Arduino that we are configuring and the device, in this case the heading encoder. Here we can define what we want the encoder to do, if we turn it left or we turn it right, uh, slower or faster. To do so we're going to choose the FSUIPC offset and use uh, one of the presets, in this case autopilot heading value. Make sure you click use and what we need to do now is set the value. In this case, when we turn the encoder left one click, we want the heading to decrease by one degree. And this is not as straightforward sometimes, uh, which brings us to the second piece of software. It is called FSUIPC7 and it is basically an interface uh, that allows other software to uh, talk with the flight simulator. Very straightforward to install and not really much more to say about it. We open the file location and go to documentation or documents. We're gonna find a guide with all the offset, which are basically all the different parameters that you can modify in the flight simulator. And if we look for 07 Charlie Charlie, we see that for each degree of heading that we're changing, we need to change the value by 182. So in the Mobi flight we type dollar minus one a two for the left and dollar plus one a two for the right. We can also tell the software that with a first turn of the encoder we want ten degrees change. In this case we set the value to dollar minus one eight two zero and dollar plus one eight two zero. Next we click OK and we make sure that the configuration is active and the software is running. Now launch Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 using the FSUIPC7. And we should be good to go, let's give it a try. Very nice, thank you for watching and stay tuned for more projects, bye bye.